chair now recognizes Ms. Green from Georgia. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. On July 25th, 2023, Chairman Comer and I sent the Department of Justice a letter requesting information related to victims of Hunter Biden, specifically women he sexually exploited and then claimed as deductions on his taxes through his law firm. But he never paid those taxes. Not surprisingly, the Department of Justice did not respond. After the DOJ's sweetheart Hunter Biden deal fell apart, by the way, led by the special counsel, David Weiss, on September 8th, 2023, Chairman Comer and I again sent a letter to the same DOJ officials asking about victims' rights issues related to Hunter Biden's sexual exploitations. DOJ once again failed to respond. Well, yesterday I found out why they don't want to talk with us. In a new email just released, by the way, from October 2020, could you please display the email? The Delaware U.S. Attorney's Office, DOJ, tax, FBI, and IRS described evidence they have related to Mann Act violations. By the way, the subject of the email says Mann Act. First, the title, Mann Act, then it's clear there are charges on the table while the Department of Justice is in hiding from meeting with me. The Department of Justice and IRS email and David Weiss's Delaware U.S. Attorney's Office, the email states there are communications with trafficker number one and trafficker number two, and that Hunter Biden had escorts who traveled across state lines. These women are victims, and the Department of Justice is refusing to protect their rights. Not only that, David Weiss, the now special counsel in charge of supposedly investigating Hunter Biden has been clearly covering up Hunter Biden's crimes since before the 2020 election, which is undoubtedly election interference. David Weiss is complicit and must be removed from the special counsel. We also have more information we subpoenaed. Let me give you an even better example based on an interview with one of Hunter Biden's victims with law enforcement. It says here that the victim, Hunter Biden's victim, stated that Biden told her that his father was the vice president and asked to Google search his name. Hunter Biden's victim stated she told Biden she was not interested in Google searching his name and just wanted to be paid. Hunter Biden's victim stated that Biden then showed her a picture of his father with President Barack Obama. Don't forget his father was vice president then. Hunter Biden's, sex, Hunter Biden's victim stated after she was shown the aforementioned picture who was the vice president of the United States with the president of the United States, Barack Obama, she became afraid. After Hunter Biden's victim left the location, she arrived back at her apartment and told her friend who she was just with, Hunter Biden's victim stated that her friend told her, you have no idea who you're dealing with. These women were terrified, terrified. He used his father, Hunter Biden used his father, the vice president of the United States to threaten his victim who he had just trafficked for sex, and the Department of Justice refuses to speak to me? Hunter Biden needs to be held accountable, accountable for his sexual exploitation of women. And we've shown more evidence. We've shown evidence. This is what it looks like. This is what Man Act violations look Mr. like. Mr. Chairman. Uh, I reclaim my time. I I I'd like to challenge time. the use of this Hunter debate Biden under Clause 6 of Rule 17. It is sad that my Democrat Point of order. colleagues Point of order. pretend to care about women's rights while allowing Hunter Biden to exploit women. This is a shame. But let's talk about... Mr. Chairman, there's a parliamentary order. challenge before us. The point, of order. point of order. Who's the point? And we'll stop the clock for you, Ms. Green. M Mr. Chairman, um, the, our colleague from Georgia has... Uh, introduced before pornographic exhibits and displayed things that are really not suitable for uh, children who might be watching. 
And uh, bathing uh, suits not suitable, Mr. Raskin. Well, 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 I'm saying I would like the witness to, I would like the member to be instructed to not introduce any pornography today, at least without running it. The, a the bathing chair suit is not pornography. Well, Mr. we can't Raskin. see it from down there, so you didn't make it available to the minority before you started. Seen it before. It's, okay. it's on an, on the internet. It's everywhere. You and you are submitting a naked woman's body. This is a bathing suit. This is a bathing suit. And it has not been clear before this, this committee. Uh, glasses on. Do you wear okay. them or not? I have contacts suit. in. Thank oh, you. Oh, congratulations. Uh, 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 chair, ask Ms. Green to proceed. Now, let's talk about more evidence the Democrats have denied that's turned out to be true. We all know Joe Biden is the big guy. And we confirmed that Hunter Biden was lobbying his father. Here's another example that was just released yesterday. This is from a timeline from one of the IRS whistleblowers in quotes, an email between Vuk Jeremic, a Serbian politician, and Hunter Biden. Did you have a chance to talk with the big man? He's receiving my prime minister on Wednesday. Please let me know if you think that what we discussed back in D.C. can be mentioned in the meeting. My domestic strategy, how I proceed in dealing with my government, very much depends on whether it happens or not. This is a conversation between Hunter Biden and Vuk Jeremich. This is called influence peddling. This is how Hunter Biden was selling his father's political power and influence. And this is a perfect example. This is evidence right here. I'd like to remind everyone that this is the beginning of the impeachment inquiry, where we're casting a wide net and finding every single person, whether it's last administration, the administration before that, and whether it's the current administration that has covered up Mr. the Chairman, crime of, of the Biden Thank family, you. and we will continue Thank pulling more evidence 54 forward. seconds over, Mr. Chairman. And, and I'll let Mr. Goldman go over 30 seconds. So we owe you 20 seconds to Mr. Moskowitz. It's your lucky day. <laughs>